morning guys happy saturday so today i am going to make some bacon waffle um for our breakfast so right now i am start cooking our pork bacon so i'm gonna show you how i make my waffle uh butter okay so every saturday we have my husband and i we call cheat day that we can eat whatever we want but not overdid it so once a week since we are um trying to lose weight so first thing first we are going to use a almond flour it's not so much carbohydrates okay so I'm gonna do a half cup okay just estimate half cup of almond flour and I am gonna use a Splenda sugar even though it's our cheat day I still trying to prepare not so crazy not so fatty okay so I'm going to put two of that and then I'm going to add some, a pinch of salt, okay, just a pinch of salt. Then I will add two eggs, instead of using a butter I am going to use a cooking oil, I will explain why. The reason why I use a cooking oil because cooking oil will help to moist your uh, pancake um, almond flour they do consume a lot of liquid in a kind of drying is completely different than regular flour so I'm gonna add this oh, one tablespoon there we go mm, there is some eggshell Maybe this eggshell okay then I'm gonna add a one-third cup of regular milk, 2% milk, okay, again like what I said, um, almond flour, they do consume a lot of liquid, and also it's kind of dry, so that's the reason we add some um, cooking oil, okay, so this is our breakfast today, and then I will cook some eggs and then the bacon waffle now even though it's a cheat day and this is a breakfast you know you wanna eat something else besides your breakfast so that's the reason why that I use almond flour and splenda sugar okay at least it's a half not too much of the carb and sugar okay so we're going to finish our bacon first because we're gonna in our um, in our waffle we will add the bacon in it. So in our bacon because this is kind of long we're gonna cut this half because I would like to put the bacon top and bottom of our waffle. Okay. So we're gonna cook the bacon before to be able to start our cooking our waffle we have to cook the bacon first because we add the bacon to our waffle okay now if you have children and you want to um to do that that would be perfectly fine for my grandchildren i do add some meat for the waffle my oldest grandson this is his favorite waffle and bacon so yeah I like to crispy my bacon first because of um, the fat. I would like to remove some of the fat from our um, bacon. Um, but I like to cook my bacon in a way. It doesn't matter bacon, a turkey bacon or pork bacon um, before I put this on my waffle. Okay. Just a little bit. So while we are continue cooking our bacon, I am going to plug our waffle maker so the easy way to pour your um, eliminate a lot of messiness to make some waffle i'm gonna put this on my measuring cup okay it's like that and i'm gonna turn off my stove i'm gonna put my bacon 
we are warming up our waffle maker okay I'm gonna put that number five number five is a bit faster now we're going to put some cooking oil in it okay even though my um, waffle maker it's non-stick I still add some a little bit oil in it um, it's a lot easier to get your waffle out okay so I like that then the top just brush some oil okay so next we're going to do is we're going to put our bacon okay what I'm going to do I'm gonna just put the uh, butter first because what I forgot that this is the stick uh, waffle maker so I'm gonna put my butter first okay don't put too much because remember we have to put the bacon in it okay to eliminate also the messiness okay now we're gonna put the bacon on the top still hot guys trust me but my fingers kind of used to it as long as it come down a little bit the just like that okay so this is the um, my waffle maker stick okay so next we're going to do is we're going to add a little bit more of butter okay this time I am going to make three together you can do that okay then right here or you can just do all together and then you can just um, cut that later on afterwards okay so we're gonna cover it just like that now while we are doing our cooking our waffle, let's prepare the eggs. We're going to make some scrambled eggs. Okay, guys. So we're going to use the same pan that we're cooking our bacon. I like the smell of the bacon in my eggs. Okay. So I remove all the oil. There's still a little bit left there. But no big deal. That's what we're going to use there. So we're going to cook four eggs. We're not going to make this crumble, so we're going to do Then we're gonna get put some black paper like that okay then a little bit salt you have to be careful the salt you don't want to be too much salt and because my husband loves hot sauce so I'm gonna put some hot sauce in the top of the eggs okay I do too. I love hot sauce. Then we're going to adjust the heat to medium and we're going to cover it just like that. Now we're going to check our waffle.
Okay, guys, so there we go. So it's pretty cooked, beautiful, brown, golden brown. I'm hot. I move this a little bit here, okay? So my husband is a bigger guy, so I'm gonna give him five sticks of bacon waffle. That's three. That's hot. I'll give him five. Look at this, guys. Okay. Then I'm gonna have three mine. There we go. So I don't need to cook another bacon because remember we put bacon in our waffle. Okay guys, so we're gonna check our eggs. There we go. So we're going to separate. And we're going to flip it. Because my husband doesn't like a soft egg, so we're going to flip this. Okay. So this is another option if you don't like scrambled eggs. Sometimes you can do that. Now we're going to cover this again for three more minutes and then it should be done. Okay guys, so I think our eggs is done. It's been three minutes. Okay. So this is another option if you don't want to cook some uh, scrambled eggs. Okay, so this is our breakfast this morning. Okay. Okay, guys, so this is our bacon waffle and, of course, the eggs. This is our breakfast today. Thank you, thank you so much, guys. I hope you like this recipe. Um, please subscribe my YouTube channel, and if you already do please don't forget to press the notification so you can receive all my incoming videos happy saturday guys be careful out there may get the show love you guys bye bye